Roderick Stephen Harvey Sr. is an American television host, producer, actor, and comedian. He hosts the Steve Harvey Morning Show, Family Feud, Celebrity Family Feud, The Miss Universe Competition, Family Feud Africa, and the arbitration-based core comedy judge Steve Harvey. Harvey began his career as a comedian. He performed stand-up comedy in the early 1980s and hosted Showtime at the Apollo and the Steve Harvey Show on the WB. He was later featured in the original Kings of Comedy after starring in the Kings of Comedy tour. His last stand-up show was in 2012. Harvey is the host of both Family Feud and Celebrity Family Feud, holding this role since 2010. He also hosted Little Big Shots, Little Big Shots Forever Young, and Steve Harvey's Thunderdome. As an author, he has written four books, including his bestseller Act Like a Lady, Think Like a Man, which was published in March 2009. In 2017, Harvey founded Steve Harvey Global, an entertainment company that houses his production company East 112 and various other ventures. He launched an African version of Family Feud and also invested in the HGNet takeover along with Anthem Sports and Entertainment. He and his wife Marjorie are the founders of the Steve and Marjorie Harvey Foundation, a nonprofit organization focused on youth education. He is a seven-time Daytime Emmy Award winner, two-time Marconi Award winner, and a 14-time NAACP Image Award winner in various categories. Harvey was born on January 17, 1957, in Welch, West Virginia, and is the son of Jesse Harvey, a coal miner, and Eloise Vera. His first name is Broderick, named after actor Broderick Crawford of the TV series Highway Patrol. Harvey had a severe stuttering problem as a child, which he eventually overcame. Harvey's family moved to Cleveland, Ohio, living on East 112th Street, which was renamed Steve Harvey Way in 2015. He graduated from Glenville High School in 1974. Shortly after high school, he attended Kent State University and West Virginia University and is a member of Omega Psi Phi fraternity but never graduated. While Harvey has talked about overcoming his early life and educational obstacles, he later conceded, it really threw my life into a downward spiral, and I regret not getting that degree.